What is up everybody, how you doing today? Welcome back to The Hunter Call of the Wild. And today, um, I have a little bit of a highlight video for all of you. Um, I've been out here hunting for hunger a lot this past weekend. Um, I had some extra time, felt like I should play, and uh, managed to find a lot of really cool stuff. For hunger was really, really good to us. Um, and we found a lot of good stuff, so much so that this video will actually be broken into two parts. And there will be a second part on Wednesday, which contains some of the kills from the live stream on Sunday night. So, yeah. So, with all that said, guys, please don't forget to hit that like button down below and hit the subscribe button as well. It really helps out the channel and allows me to continue to make videos for all of y'all to enjoy. Um, so with all that said, let's go on ahead and get into the clips. Alright you guys, well we have a wildebeest out here in front of us that is fairly large. Um, he is the max weight estimate, and his score estimate goes from 37 to 41. So he's got a pretty good shot at being diamond. So we're gonna see if we can sneak a shot in there, and that should be good, and he is going down. Let's go see how big he is. Well, I will say I haven't had a diamond wildebeest in quite a while now, actually. But just been out here looking for jackals um, because they're one of the three diamonds that I still need. So there's going to be a lot of Reventuli, Verhunga, and uh, Rancho hunting here soon. Um, but let's see what we got. And a diamond wildebeest. Let's go. 37.7 on the dot. Curious. Diamond is 37.69. Okay, so this dude like barely made it. That's still pretty cool though. Always nice to see a diamond wildebeest. Always a nice thing to run across. I mean, I mean, they are kind of common. I mean, they're not like super common, but they're definitely not as rare as the others. But hey, it's still cool to find some. Hey, there we go. There's a level 5 spring buck. Alright, nice. I haven't seen one of those in a hot minute. I figured we'd run across one eventually. I've been hunting Verhunga quite a lot here recently. Trying to find um, jackal. And spring buck are all over the place in the areas where jackal are. I mean, they are just absolutely everywhere. So, I'm just double checking. Making sure there's nothing else out here. Um, I'm glad I came up here. I almost didn't even come up to this area. But that's our level 5 out there at about 200 meters. So that should do good right there. Break out the 243 handgun. And he looks like the smaller rack. Ooh, I think we may have hit spine. Yikes. I don't know. I hope. I'm hoping. Maybe we got lung in that. I just, I had to aim a little high to get it over that hill. Um, but I'm afraid we may have shot just a touch too high. Well, here he is, the moment of truth. And that's vital blood. Alright, now the question is here. Will he troll or will he be a diamond? I'm gonna say he's gonna be just short. And yup, indeed he was. Just a little too short, and he really wasn't even that close. Off by 0.7. So that was kind of a small one. 40.61 kg is decent. It's not quite enough. You need around 40.8 is a little bit better. At least gives you a chance. Anything over 41 is pretty much diamond. Um, but uh, yeah, managed to catch the other lung. But hey, I mean... It's always good to see a level 5. I'm not going to bother taxing them because I've got plenty of spring buck. But, uh, yeah, I mean, progress is progress. I mean, who knows? Maybe we'll find a, uh, a diamond one while we're searching for jackal. I was about to say, that looks like a level 9. Alright, guys. Well, hey, I mean, I saw that guy and I thought he looked big. Alright, then. Well, um... Yeah. Well, uh, I mean, let's try and get close enough to him. I'd like to be about 150-ish. Because, as we all know, the 300 
likes to be stupid at range sometimes and I don't know why my range finding binoculars are struggling at the moment they just are so I mean here anywhere really should be fine um, and actually I'd like to get him before he turns to face me preferably so somewhere just like that and that should be good right there and he's actually gone aggressive so um, even if he got messed up we could still get him and he is messed up so I have the 454 with me let's see and I have the better bullets now so these bullets will have a whole lot more penetration than the other ones um, let's see Ooh, oh my okay I thought I could get that shot right there but he got a little too close um so let's see hopefully he'll run back here towards me hope he's not spooked now that would kind of suck oh no he's not he is definitely not spooked all right well let's just oh man this is nerve-wracking because I only have one shot oh I missed I completely missed okay well um, let me heal before he kills me round two oh he's doing this thing he's bugged out now I think yep he's bugged out the buffaloes have a bug where they now run in a complete circle up oh, and yikes all right come on come on actually I kinda wanna get on the inside of the circle um come on dude just come back around all right we're gonna wait for him to come back around got him absolutely smoked him and now he's going down just like that <laughs> that was kind of interesting um, but yeah, that is a bug that the Cape Buffaloes do now have where they will eventually just run around in a circle and We did all of that for a troll Buffalo got the penetration bug with the 300 um, Yep kind of expected that and then the last shot was as perfect as you could ask so it's a bit unfortunate but, uh, yeah, I had really hoped he'd be a diamond. I knew he probably wouldn't be with that score estimate, but hey, it's always cool to see level nine. Alrighty, guys, well, there is another Cape Buffalo right out there. And if he'll give me a, uh, a broadside shot, I didn't see him until the last second, unfortunately. Um, but it's looking like he's going to run kind of straight away. Of course he couldn't give me a slightly more broadside angle which is unfortunate um hmm I think our best bets just gonna be sit here and wait and see maybe they'll come back um, I don't know we'll just have to see all right guys here he is coming back just like I thought he would so let's go on ahead and take a shot at him once he stops or slows down or either would be nice um just not behind another buffalo preferably something just like that should be perfect and he is going down awesome that is another level 9k buffalo the last one we killed i think it was actually like right there maybe may have been one of these ones back here but it was one of these two um so, I mean, like I said, sometimes there's several legendaries in one server. Um, so, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, just maybe, he'll be a diamond. I really, really hope so. Um, I was kind of surprised to see him at first. And actually, you know, let's go ahead and take care of this aggressive female. If I can get a shot. There we go. Perfect. 
right in the brain. When they're coming straight at you, it's so easy to get that shot. But uh, let's see what we've got here. Didn't have a great estimate again, but this one is a diamond at 154.04. One of my bigger uh, small horns diamond cape buffalo. So yeah, not bad. I'll take that. Barely got into that lung, but did the job that we needed, so I will take it all day long. Let's go, guys. Super, super happy about that. Diamond K Buffalo down, and we even won a little competition. Like, right in front of me. Oh. Hi. That's a level 5 